It's been more than three months since a mass shooting at a downtown Louisville bank that left five people and the shooter dead. WDRB Stefan Johnson tells us about the latest effort to help the family of one of the heroes who responded to the scene. This was the scene of that mass shooting at Old National Bank in downtown Louisville in April of this year. This Officer Will is a miracle, but he has a long road ahead of him. Officer Nick Wilt was one of the first to respond to the shooting. He is, Nick is a hero. He did not wait a moment. His mom said she looked at his hands and they were steady and he rushed in when everyone else was rushing out. He rushed in and he saved lives that day. Since then, Officer Wilt has traveled the long road to recovery in the hospital with his family members by his side. We're coming up on Wilt Week. Rebecca Grignan Reeker is executive director of the Louisville Metro Police Foundation and says Wilt Week is a week long fundraiser. Yes, this money that has been raised allows him to have his family with him all the time. They don't have to be at their jobs. I've been in law enforcement um, and, and working with law enforcement for 15 years and that's a true definition of a hero. Ashley Bratcher is executive assistant with the St. Matthews Police Department and got the ball rolling after being contacted by the president of Independence Bank. We're always on the same team. Um, they support each other, we support each other. Same thing with the banking industry and that's why they got in too. Wilt Week starts on Tuesday, August 1st with a fundraising event every day that week. Tuesday, we start a national night out um, where we will have donation boxes set up. That day, a local restaurant chain is also making a significant commitment. But Texas Roadhouse is also doing 100% of proceeds that day at all four of their locations. Um, they start, they open at three o'clock and every, every dime goes to Officer Wilt. To find out how you can attend the events or to donate, just head to our website and click on this story. With photojournalist Jeff Gordon, I'm Stefan Johnson, WDRB News. So amazing to see all of those people coming together to support Officer Wilt's family.